So we're back here with some more of the twerk. <coughs> My bad. So we're back at it with some more of the twerk becomes human. We're with Connor and Hank. So let's see what we're doing here. Who are we investigating? You're starting to piss me off with that coin, Connor. Sorry, Lieutenant. Hi, oh. Hank. Shit, what's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? <laughs> yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's buttoning their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, Christ, now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was gonna be a shitty day. So what do we got? A group of four androids. They knew the building and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. Check the roof. Not yet. There's so much to look at. Mm. We have to make sure we check it out. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They probably thought the androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. Okay, so right now we're just listening to it. Camera. One of the station employees managed to get away. He's in shock. I'm not sure when we'll be able to talk to him. How many people were working here? Just two employees and three androids. The deviants took the humans hostage, broadcast their message live, then made their getaway from the roof. Not bad. Roof? Yeah, they jumped with parachutes. We're still trying to figure out where they landed, but the weather's not helping. Well, if you want to take a look at the video broadcast. Oh, shit. Oh, Lieutenant, this is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened. The FBI would take you over the investigation. You soon be off the case. Oh, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. Don't fuck up my crime scene. What a fucking prick. Yeah, he is. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. All right, well, let's have a look around. Okay. We got a lot to investigate. You know, Okay, Lieutenant. They didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let them in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. station androids in the kitchen. There's no evidence that they were involved, but we didn't know what else to do with them. Hmm. Possible complication, interrogate. Okay, but first let's investigate everything that's right here. Okay. That you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life, and now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Defense RA9. Deviants say RA9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective. The 
looks like we might have found ourselves an R and I wait huh? You mean inside of compasses? Okay, so compasses are that like what we already know. Identified its model and serial number. Anything else I should know? No. Nothing. Where way to react, Connor? I want to interrogate those androids, but first I want to invest, you know, check everything in case, you know, going in there ends this section, you know. Taking so long, I wish I could be able to run. And then there's this the blue blood. He likes the taste right there off the. Come on, Connor. Why? Maybe he's not there. Maybe he's hidden. Maybe Connor won't find him. Connor's not that bad a good a detective, huh? Oh, look, there's some people up here. Made their way up through the whole building, past all the guards, and jumped off the roof with parachutes. Pretty fucking impressive, I'd say. they managed to smuggle in a big bag like that they didn't someone brought it in for them oh that's strange they planned a perfect operation but got the number of parachutes wrong unless one of the deviants was left behind See a trail? I don't see a trail. Oh, there it is. I'm scared. Jesus. 
save this. Man. You have to stop them. If they destroy it, we won't learn anything. We can't save it. It's too late. We'll just get ourselves killed. No, I said destroy it. I hit the wrong button. I hit the wrong button. I didn't want him to die. I didn't want Connor to die. Ah. I made the wrong choice. I'm sorry, Zivia. And I still wanted to go back to him and interrogate those androids. But I didn't want to get Simeon shot. I really didn't want to get Simeon shot. I I made a mistake, man. Oh well. I I didn't make the I did choose the the setting to make it a choice where I will lose a character if I fuck up. I guess that's that choice, huh? Family, Luthor, neutral, Kara, mentally unstable. Bro, I wouldn't know what I'd be doing if I was like this. Trusting Luthor right off the bat after he did that. I get it, he could use an excuse, but what if he did the same thing? Hello? I'm looking for Rose. Is she here? What do you want with her? I need to talk to her. She doesn't want to talk. Go away. Please, I really need to see her. I'm Rose. What can I do for you? I was told you could help us. Help you? Come on. It's better if we talk inside. So far, Kara has literally killed two people. I know about this up like an. Do you like think I we can trust them? We don't have a choice. people oh well, he's got the second one killed what's your name Alice. she's running a fever we've spent the last few nights outside she's exhausted there's a spare room upstairs you can put her to bed and I'll bring her something to eat Adam will you show them upstairs I could tell the kid don't like us. I would understand, honestly. What she's doing is like, I think, a felony. That's at least what I think. My bad. There we go. Because that's like a lot of prison time because these are like, I think privately owned. I think that's what it's supposed to mean. Okay. Let's get you ready for bed. Just do that in one stop because of me. We've got to get across the border. 
We need sure. a rest. Get a good night's sleep, and we'll set off again tomorrow. Why do humans hate us? We didn't do anything wrong. Maybe it's a misunderstanding. Maybe they just need time to understand what we really are. Why can't we just talk to each other? They'd see we're not bad. Mm. I really wish. Maybe one I wish. day we will. I don't know what you like, but I made you Rose's world famous spaghetti. You'll be back on your feet in no time. There's something for her fever. Thank you. I'll get these washed and dried. Sleep tight, Alice. I'll be downstairs if you need anything. Close. Get some sleep. And tomorrow, you'll be stronger than me. I'll stay with her a while. Let's go talk to Rose. All right, then. I'll leave her in your capable hands. I mean, I guess I will trust someone I just barely met that helped erase my memory and kidnap the kid. Yeah. Exactly what I'm going to do, huh? I wish I could be able to, like, walk a little faster. I didn't get your name. I'm Kara. This is my son, Adam. I'm Rose, but you know that already. Come and have a seat, Kara. It's Kara. 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 So are you going to tell me what a deviant's doing in the snow with a little girl? Oh, man, it's a long story. Uh, this one. Her father was beating her. When I saw what was happening, something snapped inside of me. All of a sudden, I felt like her life was more important than mine. I had to protect her. So we ran away. I understand. Why, help? Why are you helping us? Most humans hate androids. My people were often made to feel their lives were worthless. Some mm. survived, but only because they found others who helped them along the way. Right. I know what she's talking about. We're not the first ones to come here. These past few weeks, we've seen more and, and more. I don't know what's going on, but something's happening. The border. We've heard you help androids cross the border. Can you help us? The only way is over the river, and it's mostly frozen in winter. It's very risky. And after that android speech on TV, everybody's on edge. It's probably safer for you to stay here until things settle down. We can't keep hiding like this. Alice seems to feel safe and have a normal life. We have to get across that border. No matter what. Please. You've got to help us. Rose, come quickly. What's happened? What's happened? Got to move. Can't run. What's going on? It's Mary. She just shut down. We escaped together. <sighs> we used to talk about what we would do once we got across the border. I loved her. I loved her more than anything. 
will I do without her? I wasn't sleepy. But I guess let's see what happens. I guess yeah, the course is like the kid walk up. To stay in her room any longer. I have no idea what the right just happened. Yes, I'm fine. Shouldn't you be sleeping or eating the spaghetti that the woman left for you? We can't hide them. Not after what those deviants did today. It's too dangerous. Do you know what will happen if the police find them here? We'll go to prison, Mom. Do you understand me? Prison! Adam! We've already talked ab about this. I oh. No! I won't back down this time. You're going to ruin our lives, and for what? For a bunch of machines? They are not machines! They are alive! I'm alive! You're alive! They... They're nothing! And none of this would be happening if Dad was still here. I will not stand for that kind of talk. I'm not going to prison because you want to help these freaks. That is enough, Adam! That's enough! <coughs> oh, man. Sorry about that. You okay? Don't mind him. He just speaks his the truth, honestly. Sometimes he just boils over. It's been hard since his dad passed away. <sighs> it's, it's, it, it, it is, it is but truth, he's a though. fine boy. He's just scared. I'll go see about getting you across the border tonight, okay? You stay here. I won't be long. I'm pretty sure we could figure something out instead. What now? Wait for Rose. Oh my god. Let's just uh, flip that back on over to the other page. Hold on. Before I decide to join you. Can't walk in between there, I guess. Hey, look at that. Blue blood. What it feels like to lose. Let's see if you're okay. You okay? I'm gonna go back to the room. I'm pretty sure it's cold. You know what happened back there, don't you? You know, but you don't want to tell me?
police. It's the police. What are we gonna do? Oh shit. Uh, they know we're here. We have to open the door. I knew this was gonna happen. Okay. I knew it. Is that it? Okay. Hurry, Luther. Take Alice and hide... Upstairs. Come on, Alice. She's with the little girl, so it gives him an excuse. Okay. Good evening, ma'am. Sorry to disturb you. We've had reports of androids in the area. With all this deviant business going on, you can't be too careful. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Sure. May I come in? Uh, of course. Good evening, young man. Good evening. And she's having coffee. Would you like a cup of coffee? I'd love one. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? Any unexpected visitors? No. No? No, nothing in particular. Is anyone else in the house? Alice. There's... There's my daughter. She's asleep upstairs. Do you have any androids here? Yes. We used to for helping in the garden. Where the fuck is the cops out? But we got rid of it. Try to make it, make it more believable in case he finds a blue blood. Boom, an answer right there. Oh, oh, why haven't you got rid of it? Oh, you know, it takes a minute to dispose of carefully. Any more questions? There's a cup of joe. Thanks. So far, thank you, God. I didn't leave it on that one page. I I didn't even think he was gonna look at it at all. What's your name, son? A Adam. M my name is Adam. Is everything all right, Adam? The androids they tired he needs a rest he's been working in the garden all day do you know anything about deviants have you seen any no no i i, I haven't seen anything very <laughs> unbelievable act kid i better go thanks for the coffee have a nice evening. You're a son of a man that you want to step out of the cold for a while. Is somebody else in the house? Uh, oh, washing machine. It's nothing, the, the washing machine. It's an old model, it makes a terrible racket. Sorry for the convenience. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening, Adam. You need to work on your acting skills, kid. We got us odd cop. He's gone. It's okay, Alice. 
Alice. We'll be safe now. It's Rose. Get yourselves ready. We leave tonight. All right. I wonder what all those lock things are, but either way, I'll see you guys on the next one. We finished this one with Clara, and I'm pretty sure the next one would be with Marcus. Back with Marcus, of course. So as usual, I'll see you on the next one. Peace.